you end up getting injured in the very first series of the game and you're carted off the field. In your brain, as you're being carted off the field, what are you thinking? I knew I was in bad shape. You know, when the, uh, the guy fell on me, you know, I felt some bad things happen on my, in my ankle and uh, went to the sideline in the tent and they're like, all right, we need to get x-rays. You know, you're fearing the worst and um, went in, got the x-rays. They're like, well, nothing's broken. And uh, I was like, all right, well, I'll tape it up and let's see what I can do. Uh, came up short, but had a, had a good run there at the end to, to get a two minute drive to go take the lead, you know, with, uh, with not too much time left. And uh, you know, ultimately that was the last game I played last year. At what point do you have to draw the line and say, I can do this, I can gut this out, it's gonna be okay, and there's no chance? It's a fine line, <laughs> yeah. That, that has to go pretty far for me to, to be able to cross that line. Um, uh, but being a quarterback, you're able to maybe play with a little bit more, uh, a little bit uh, further injuries than you would at some other positions just because you're not you know, getting contacted every play, you're not having someone push on you every play, things like that. Um, but you do have to be able to move a little bit and, and be able to protect yourself. Fresh start in 2023 for a lot of different reasons. Play fake, option, right side, Tannehill keeps, five, end zone. Yeah, okay! Touchdown, Titans! Ryan Tannehill! One of them is new offensive coordinator Tim Kelly. What do you like about him and his style? Uh, I love working with Tim. He's, he's straightforward. You know, he has a lot of energy up in front of the room, which is great. I think he, he works to engage the room. I think he has a great mind. He has a lot of great thoughts, a lot of new thoughts that, that we haven't had here or haven't had here in the past, and um, new ways to attack the defense. So excited to, uh, to put those to work. How important is it for you and him to kind of be on the same page and to really establish some chemistry early? Oh, it's huge. You know, I think. That's one of the most important things is for a quarterback and offensive coordinator to, to see things the same way, whether it's you know, knowing what a, a play caller wants to get out of a certain play. You know, there's, there's certain concepts where, um, depending on what the play caller wants, you can, you can look at it a couple different ways. Is he trying to get a shot? Is he trying to just get a completion and get us back on track? Uh, just being able to talk those things out with him, make sure that, that we're both on the same page. When, when a play call comes in, I know, okay, hey, he just wants to get this thing back on track. He wants to get a completion or a, a similar play call might come like, all right, he's trying to take a shot here. If it's not there, then we can check it down. You know, So uh, it's a lot of nuanced type things. If you look at the play on paper, it might look very similar, but by the play call, you know, you're able to know that. There's a new wide receiver in the room, DeAndre Hopkins. And I've got to ask you about him because I know there's a lot of talent on this Titans team, but he comes in with a bit of a reputation. Tannehill spreading out to the right, looking, firing downfield. There's Hopkins! Hopkins no. makes the catch inside the 25-yard line. They will spot it at the 24. He goes out of bounds. Yeah, it's been fun. You know, I uh, I didn't really know what to expect uh, that on the field he's at, as advertised. You know, he's being able to, uh, to consistently make those plays for us and just getting used to his body language has been a lot of fun for me and, and where can I throw balls where only he can get it. What are you most looking forward to in the 2023 season? Getting back out there. You know, I think it's a... Uh, it's a great opportunity for this team, this organization, to go out and have a great 2023 season. You know, it's a lot of work that's going to go into it, but excited about the opportunity at hand.